Have you ever wondered what Minecraft would be like if everything looked realistic? Like, of course the map is still made out of mostly blocks, but imagine the water flowed like actual water and the lava actually moves as slow as real lava moves. And when you threw a snowball at something, the snow wouldn't just magically disappear, but it would fall onto the ground. Well, today we're gonna be checking out realistic Minecraft, or as I like to call it, Minecraft in 2050. Here we go. Okay, so we are starting off the video in a field with oak planks. Okay, so this just looks like a pretty, this, this looks like normal Minecraft so far. Okay, so we got a wa- Yo, what? This is what I'm saying. Oh, how does it just spill out like that? Normally the door would block the water, but in realistic Minecraft, anything goes. If you're shocked from that one like me, just wait until we get farther in the video. These get crazy. Oh gosh, we got TNT here. Uh, what? Wait, underwater? Wait. What? I did not know TNT can explode underwater. I swear in normal Minecraft, it can't do that, right? Why would he be taking off the, oh my gosh, he's gonna drop it in and it's just gonna go straight up. This is gonna be so satisfying. And this is only one TNT block too. He's not even putting four in there. Holy cow, I wanna see what it's like with four. I don't know what mod this is, but I need to figure out what it is because this looks so cool. Oh, this one looks interesting. We got a glass, two glass cubes filled with, Oh, that is so satisfying. But then how do you clean up the water is what I'm thinking, right? Like, cause in normal Minecraft, right? You can just use a bucket and scoop up the main water source. But with this one, there's water going everywhere. It's probably something the Minecraft players in 2050 know and we have to figure out. Oh, uh, here we go with the lava. Okay, so I've actually made a couple of YouTube shorts about this realistic Minecraft thing. They've done really well. So if you're watching this from shorts, it's, oh my gosh. Dude, that's so satisfying. It looks like, Slime almost. Anyways, back to what I was saying. I've made a couple of super viral shorts about this topic already. So if you're here from shorts, thank you. What's going on here? Iron blocks. Is he making like an iron golem or something? Okay, yeah. We got an iron golem here. No, he's not gonna drop. My computer would explode. Even like the like shadows and, and everything like he's glowing this is like almost too realistic look how it's like seeping through the fences i wonder how fire looks in realistic minecraft i have so many questions all right so we are now in a grass field here looks like that's just stone inside those fences he just turned that stone into lava yeah dude it, it looks like slime it looks like sticky doesn't it you can't tell me that lava doesn't look sticky. But wow, that animation looks fantastic. If I'm being honest, this looks like a whole new game. All right, like I said, these are just gonna keep getting crazier and crazier. So it looks like we got water and he has a lava bucket. So I think we're gonna get some, some of... See, okay, the water is still there, even though he took away the water source. <laughs> like, bro, what if you accidentally place a water bucket? Where does all the water go? It seems almost actually impossible to play a real game of Minecraft in the realistic version. I don't know, that's just me, but let's see what this guy's gonna do now. We got cobblestone going over the... The... The smoke. The steam. Wait. But the... The obsidian looks the exact same, no? I don't know why I was assuming the obsidian to look different, but it didn't at all. Still pretty cool, not gonna lie, still pretty cool. All right, let's see what we got next. I am prepared, guys. Like the video if you want this realistic version of Minecraft. All right, so we got the water source right in the middle. We got water, we've seen this before. I'm not too surprised by now. Oh, the sponge. Shut up, bro, that is so cool. Even the sponge like looks like it changed a little bit. It looks like fluffy. Actually, I don't like the texture of this. What? Now y'all are just doing too much. They're adding physics into Minecraft? The sponge, when it got pushed, looked like a plushy toy or something. I don't know, y'all. I might like the original version of Minecraft a little bit better. All right, so I've showed you the water in realistic Minecraft, the lava in realistic Minecraft, but now we're moving over to the animals in realistic Minecraft. Believe it or not, all of the animals are realistic, and this is a pig. Um... I don't know about you guys. This makes me a little uncomfortable. If I were to get realistic Minecraft, I would not want the animals to be realistic. Like, yes, it would be cool to have a pig farm or something. I don't know, dude. It's kind of weird. All right, and I actually don't know what this is. Wait, it's grass? Dude, 
that's so cool. It's like tall grass. This is reminding me of like Pokemon right now or something, dude. Is he gonna catch a Pokemon in the field? That's literally what it's reminding me of. All right, gamers, we're gonna pause the video for a second here and do a little pop quiz. I guess it's not really a quiz. It's more of a questionnaire. But guys, I want you to tell me in the comments at what age did you start playing Minecraft? For me, I think my dad introduced me at like nine or 10. It's been almost 10 years. And I'm really interested to see when you guys started playing. All right, back to the video. Okay, so this is one of my favorite parts of realistic Minecraft. It is snow. Now, I don't know if you know this about me, but I love the cold, I love the winter time, so anything cold related, I'm all about. And snow being realistic is so cool. I'm not kidding, I would get the mod specifically for this. And obviously, with snow, comes snowballs. And with snowballs come snowball fights. So I really want to, I don't know about you guys, drop in the comments if you guys would do this with me. I want to have a realistic Minecraft snowball fight with you guys. I feel like that would be so much fun. Again, I'm going to keep saying this, but it looks messy. It also, you know, some of this doesn't look super realistic. It kind of just looks like packing peanuts everywhere a little bit, like the little circles everywhere, especially when you get really up close. But gosh, dude, it's still so cool. All right, guys, this is about to get crazy. We are now doing parkour in realistic Minecraft. Of course, the water bucket fall, but these are gonna get crazy. And it looks like we got a snow jump now. What is this? Okay, in normal Minecraft, you can't do that. Maybe I just don't know my Minecraft very well, but I did not know that you could just jump on snow and it will save your fall. All right, this part makes me a little bit uncomfortable. I'm not gonna lie. This is Minecraft slime. It almost looks like what the lava animation looked like, but it's like bubbling and stuff. I, I really don't like it. But if you already didn't like that slime, you're gonna not like it a lot more because this guy literally fills his entire house with slime twice. He does it on the upstairs and now he's about to do it on the downstairs. I would be so claustrophobic. I know that this isn't real life, but ah, he's just all up in the slime. And look at how the slime just falls off of Steve like that. So bizarre, it, it's, it's dripping down too. I don't know how you create a mod like this and how you would run this on a computer that can actually run this. My MacBook would be on fire. Oh no, oh no, the sheep is gonna get, don't do it, don't do it, the poor sheep, the poor sheep, no! It's last little breath, it's last little face. That was so sad. Someone go save that sheep for me, please. Oh my gosh, that is that is so sad. Wait a second, I just realized something. That sheep was a normal Minecraft sheep. That wasn't a realistic sheep. I thought that all the animals in 2050 are realistic. I guess that sheep never changed. All right, here we go. We got the TNT flint and steel. This is just so satisfying to me. Let's see a blow up here. Ah, oh my gosh, wait, it actually like explodes. There's like an actual animation of exploding. And look at the fall. It's so funny. It really doesn't even look like normal Minecraft dolls. It's like a, like a completely different game. Whoa, going from the middle. Look at those blocks just flying off to the side like that. And continuing with the TNT theme, it looks like we're now going over to a church. Oh no. Oh no. Look at that glass. <gasps> what? That's so crazy. I swear, if I had this mod, this is all I would do in the game. Just keep exploding stuff. I would put way more than one TNT. I would put like 15 and just watch the entire world explode. Maybe I'm a little bit crazy for that. But you can't lie, that would be so much fun. Well, the only thing I have to say to Minecraft in 2050 is wow. 